With J.J. Watt's recent announcement that he'll be retiring at the end of the season, it's time to look at what his legacy will be. Is he one of the best defenders in this generation? Absolutely. He's also a three-time Defensive Player of the Year, which puts him with LT and Aaron Donald for the most all-time. Unfortunately, injuries robbed him of those numbers year after year, even though his peak was absolutely elite. He'll end with about 111 and a half sacks is where he's at right now, but he's not gonna be in the 150, 170, 200 range, which he actually had the ability to do without those injuries. Now in 2014, he was robbed of NFL MVP by Aaron Rodgers. He had 20 and a half sacks. He had five touchdowns. He was a demon on the field. Still, even though he may not be in the GOAT discussion for a defensive end, he'll gladly accept Canton's call as soon as he is eligible, knowing that he's the best defender, the def best defensive end in this generation.